Hey cuties, what's up and welcome back to my Roblox channel. Now before we get going, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. So in today's role playing video, I switch lives with a rich brat. Okay, Holly, what do you say I get dinner ready and then we can have some calm down time? you the chef has the night off so i thought we'd make some mac and cheese you do mean truffle mac and cheese right with that special 200 dollars cheese from whole foods no i mean the kind that comes in a box and i can make it on the stove <gasps> Ew, what food comes out of a box who do you think i am if it's not from whole foods or flown in from another country there is no way i am eating it okay well then is there anything else in the house that i can make you i don't suppose a poor girl like you knows how to make but I'm happy to go in the backyard and dig up some snails for you to eat. You literally disgust me, peasant. Why am I doing this again? Oh, right. Focus on the big picture, Mackenzie. If you're saving for a beach trip with Sky, a beach trip with Sky is going to be totally worth it. On second thought, I'm not even that hungry anymore. The sight of your knockoff outfit kind of made me lose my appetite. Okay, then. Well, your parents won't be home for another couple of hours, so what do you want to do? Well, I've always wanted a garden gnome. Oh, well, garden gnomes are cool. I totally love all the animated gnome movies. I'm sorry, why are you still talking? My parents do not pay you to talk. Sorry. I've had ceramic gnomes in the past, and those are super duper boring. So what exactly were you thinking? So stand outside with a top hat and a lantern and pretend to be a gnome until my parents get home. What? Holy, it's literally freezing outside. Not my problem. You asked me what I wanted to do, and I want to play gnome. So go be a gnome. Meanwhile. Uh, this is the most humiliating thing. two Lamborghinis and a private jet and give me like a million dollars for an allowance is not fair. Oh great, now I have to be seen looking like an idiot in public. Ugh. Moments later. I put up a lot with that little girl, but today really drew the line. I just don't understand why Holly gets all the privilege of all those nice things. If that was me, I would never act the way she does. If I had that kind of money, I would help people out or do good things for my family and not make my babysitter into a garden gnome. Hello, little girl. From. I'm sorry, dear. I didn't mean to overhear, but you seem very upset. What's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. I don't want to bore you about the details of my life. No, tell me. It's just, I'm babysitting this rich brat, and she is totally awful. She's so entitled and treats everyone like trash. She has no concept for money and doesn't even know how lucky she is. And just looks down on everybody. Wow, that does sound awful. I just don't understand why she gets the privilege in life and she's a bad person. It just doesn't make any sense. Why doesn't the universe reward people for being good and not a total brat? That is a very good question, but I'm sure Holly's life isn't as glamorous as you might think. Yeah, sure it's not. Why don't you just go to sleep, dear, and I bet when you wake up in the morning, things will seem different. Yeah, sure, whatever. The next morning. I heard you screaming. No, everything is not okay. I'm not Holly. I'm Mackenzie. I stopped and talked to this witch on my way home last night. And somehow we switched bodies. Please, can you please believe me? Okay, Holly. I guess you're having another one of your mornings. Well, whoever you are, your gourmet breakfast is waiting for you and the private helicopter is set to go as soon as you're ready. So, come on. Private helicopter? Yes, that's right. You know what? Maybe this isn't so bad after all. Meanwhile... Uh, my butler so useless. He knows that his job is to wake me up and that if he doesn't, I'll be late for school. <gasps> ah, I'm poor! Mackenzie, are you okay? Uh, why did you just call me Mackenzie? And why did you just barge into my room? Mackenzie, are you feeling okay? Ew, don't touch me, you peasant! Excuse me? You heard me. Get your poor hands off of me. Now, where's my breakfast? Who do you think you're talking to, young lady? Um, you, clearly. Do you need to get your hearing checked? Ugh, what did they warn me that the new butler is so dumb? You better watch your mouth, little missy. If you don't tell me what to do, that's it. When you get home from school, you're grounded for a month. Oh, please, like anyone could ground me. 
moments later. Hey, Gurley, what's up? You didn't text me this morning. Oh, good. You must be the new driver. It's about time. I am totally leaving you a bad review because you're late. Uh, Mackenzie, are we role-playing for something that you didn't tell me about? And if we are role-playing, what part am I playing? Ew, why does everyone keep calling me my idiot babysitter's name? I'm clearly not Mackenzie. I am way prettier. Wait a minute. What's going on here? Mackenzie, are you messing with me? Will you stop? Holly. Um, I don't suppose you have a unicorn hiding around this mansion. One unicorn coming right up. Oh my god! Hmm, I wonder what kind of clothes Holly has in her closet. I mean, when in Rome, right? Whoa, look at all these designer clothes! All the Gucci and Prada and yeah, she has thousands of dollars worth of Chanel. Ah, I've never worn a Chanel shirt before. Hmm, maybe life as Holly isn't that bad. Moments later. Can I help you? I'm sorry, Miss Holly is busy at the moment. Please come back another time. No, no, no. I don't think you understand. This is super urgent. Sky! No, Mr. Butlerman, sir. This is my best friend. She can come in. First, I've heard of you having a best friend. Sky, why don't we talk in Holly? I mean, my room. Oh, my God, it's you. I knew that little monster at your house couldn't have been you. Well, you're right about one thing. Holly is a monster. Okay, two questions before I totally freak out. How on earth did this happen? story. I stopped and talked to a witch on the way home. I guess the details don't really matter now, but I don't know how to reverse the spell she put on us. So what am I supposed to do? Sit next to Holly in class? I'll lose my mind! Sky, really calm down. It's not that bad. Seriously, I mean, Holly's life is kind of fun. You mean you're okay living Holly's life? I mean, I'm willing to wait it out a few days. It's really not that bad. I mean, Sky, she has a private jet. Okay, well, I mean, as long as you're fine with it. Meanwhile... Okay, does anyone know the sum for this equation? Anyone? Anyone at all? Uh, Mackenzie? 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 Excuse me, are you talking to me? Why, yes, I asked if you could solve the sum of this equation. Ew, why would I do that? And why are you talking to me anyways? You're pathetic and old. Don't let her get to you! Don't let her get to you! <laughs> Mackenzie, you cannot talk to me like that, or well, I will have to ask you to go to the principal's office. Shh, I can talk to you however I want. My dad literally owns the entire school, so I kind of have immunity here, pal. <laughs> well, I guess class is over. Hey, Mackenzie! Oh, hello, peasant. My books are right over there if you want to carry them to my next class for me. What? Mackenzie, it's me, Josh. Oh, so peasant boy has a name. Anyway, my books aren't going to move themselves, so let's go. Ta-ta. Meanwhile. Huh, no wonder why Holly's parents hire me to babysit her. There's literally no one around this place. There's got to be someone I can talk to. Oh, hey, how's your afternoon going? Ah, I'm so sorry, Holly. Is something not to your liking? I'll fix it right away for you, madame. No, no, everything's fine. I just wanted to talk. Talk? Am I in trouble? Please don't make your dad fire me, miss. No, no one's in trouble. I would never fire you. Huh, I guess Holly is such a brat that no one around here will even talk to her. Man, that is pretty lonely. Hey, what are you up to? Please, don't fire me. I need this job. Whoa, whoa, calm down. I'm not firing anyone. Jeez. Wow, okay, Holly sure has a lot of money and lots of Chanel, but her life is pretty lonely. Oh, hey, girly, what's up? No time for nicknames, Mackenzie. This is serious. Holly is totally ruining your life. She got sent to the principal's office and even she called Josh a peasant! Josh! Okay, okay, I've heard enough. I want my own life back. This is fun and all, but totally not what it seems. Ugh, about time that you say that! Okay, so what do we do? I say we 
to grab Holly, I mean, grab me, and track down that witch. A few moments later. Look, look, there she is! Hey, I don't know if you remember me, but whatever spell you put on us, you have to reverse it. I don't recognize you, dear, but that blonde girl looks familiar. Yeah, that's because it's me just trapped in her body. Look, you somehow made my best friend switch lives with a rich brat, and we need you to switch them back immediately. Hey, don't call me a brat, you peasant. You're lucky you're allowed indoors with that outfit. I'm sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. Quick, Holly, give her some money as a bribe. You're the one in my body, genius, which means you have the purse, so you give her money. Oh, oopsies, that's right. Here you go, now please help us. Okay, you seem like nice enough girls. Once you realize that the privilege of being rich aren't exactly what they seem, you'll switch back to your own body. You know, when I left your house the other night, I was extremely upset and really jealous of you. But then I experienced what your life is actually like and it's really, really lonely. I'm sorry I didn't realize that. I just want my own life back. And I just want my closet full of Gucci clothes back. The next morning. Ah, finally, I'm me again. Wait, does that mean my private jet is gone? So thank you guys so much for watching and congratulations to Penny the Penguin for being our post certification winner. If you guys want to be our next post certification winner, all you have to do is turn those post certifications on and comment done when you're